at Nordam, uh, I'm the owner of Sia Green, it's organic farming. We have an uh, organic farm. It was already organic from 2008, so that's already a long history. We mostly grow organic grains like peas, wheat, oats and barley. All starts with healthy soil and I think it doesn't make a difference if we talk about raising a baby to a kid and to a human person or um, we talk about uh, take care of our cats or our cows. Everything starts with the soil and uh, if the soil has no, no food, has no uh, organic activity, then they will grow nothing and the product what is growing also has low content, uh, low nutrients and what we eat as human persons or our animals eat also have this low content and I strongly believe that uh, it's not an issue about organic or it's about conventional. I think it's more that we need to think from the principle of soil. Healthy soil brings uh, good yields and a healthy product. And I think worms are the most easy indicator simply to see that the soil is active. And for worms are very important because from one way we give the food to the soil and then we think it is going to the plant. But in the soil it's not going that easy. It's like the same like in your stomach. In our stomach we also have bacteria which help to transform the food into the nutrients what can go in your body. And in the soil it works the same. And with this the, the, the worms and uh, microorganisms have a really important function. So it is soil where which has worms is mostly active and that's a good sign. If you look in general in the Baltics we are really still below zero. Um, uh, and there is still a lot to do to bring the soils back to uh, active soils, to your, your nutrients level, especially your phosphor levels are very low in general. And if you see in, the, in West Europe, it, in, uh, it is so high that even we cannot use so much nutrients in uh, in organic way, uh, the soil is still so rich, it is still rich enough for 20 years. Uh -huh. And in the Baltics, it's the opposite way. We made our soils empty. We are growing now organic grains and we do it in a strategy that it, with the lowest input to keep your soil healthy and get them all the time on a higher level, we can get the maximum in crops and yields out simply because of the economics. I think if you want to do the system correct, somewhere it is better to add also animals in your production. But on the other side, uh, animal, it's a lot of capital what needs to be invested. We don't have a lot of people here, so where you export these products. And on the other side, it brings a lot of extra work in which people are ready to do this job. Uh -huh.